Welcome to Pyro Sales training video on how to set up your RKC digital temperature controller. Proper setup of your new RKC digital temperature controller will mean you get the best performance out of its sophisticated controls. Here are some guidelines to help you get yours up and running. RKC controllers are able to accept a thermocouple, a three-wire RTD as well as voltage and current inputs. Typically, they are supplied pre-configured to the correct sensor. If not, this can be changed in the controller's setup. Both RTD sensors and thermocouples have colour-coded wiring, so make sure to comply with convention. In Australia, we use ANSI colour-coded thermocouples, where the red wire is negative. Three-wire RTDs have two red wires and one white wire. The measurable resistance here is between the white wire and either of the reds. The additional red wire is to compensate for lead wire resistance, ensuring you get a more accurate measurement. Normal practice is to install in a panel or enclosure using a licensed electrician with the wiring attached to accessible terminals for power, sensors and so on. Once the wires are connected to the controller or the accessible terminals, you're ready to apply power to your RKC digital temperature controller. You can then enter your set point and let it control to the desired temperature. The factory set control settings will, for most applications, give you excellent control. However, you have the option to use RKC's renowned auto-tune function to optimize the control of your process.